amid the exponential growth of AI data centers globally, the Canadian province of Alberta has emerged as a key North American hub in what's now a multi-billion dollar market. And it's a high demand sector that cleantech micro cap Kalina Power now looks poised to secure a valuable foothold in. Back in August 2024, Kalina signed an MOU with a large, well-established US-based data center developer to co-develop data centers in the Alberta region using power supplied by Kalina's natural gas-fired power plants, incorporating carbon capture and sequestration. Under the proposed terms of the project development agreement, both parties will work together to facilitate the necessary permitting and regulatory requirements for each project facility. And while the drafting of definitive agreements is still in progress and could still include additional scope not previously contemplated in the original MOU, the company remains of the view that both parties are on track to proceed to binding agreements in the near term. When the MOU was signed back in August, it precipitated a 120% hike in Kalina's share price. And the market's initial reaction points to the looming opportunity in Alberta which is well supported by a positive regulatory environment. Demand for AI data centers continues to skyrocket and developers scouring for the right location have proactively singled out Alberta as the place to be, with policymakers estimating that the province's growing reputation as a data center hub could attract up to $100 billion of investment over the coming years, simultaneously creating thousands of new jobs. The shift has been backed by the Alberta provincial government, who are making moves to ensure Alberta becomes Canada's top tech hub with the release of its first official roadmap designed to attract large-scale investment for AI-focused data centers. Alberta is also attracting big players to invest in power-hungry AI data center projects led by Canadian entrepreneur and business identity Kevin O'Leary, who recently issued a bold proposal to develop potentially the world's largest AI data center in northwest Alberta. Dubbed Wonder Valley, the $70 billion proposal includes data centers along with the associated logistics and transport infrastructure. To power them, the proposal outlines the development of off-grid natural gas and geothermal power sources, providing low carbon electricity to hyperscalers looking to capitalize on the data center boom. And according to Alberta Technology Minister Nate Glubish, one of the biggest bottlenecks for developers globally is access to electricity. In turn, the delivery of effective clean power solutions has the potential to deliver major value upside for companies such as Kalina, which is now positioned to leverage its established presence in the Canadian energy markets to play a key role in future project development. As government policymakers ponder how the province can attract developers to build data centres while faced with tight electricity supplies, the door is open for companies like Kalina to bridge crucial gaps as a power supplier for what's increasingly shaping up as insatiable demand. Kalina Managing Director Ross McLaughlin is adamant Kalina's low CO2 emissions power projects are perfectly placed to meet this demand. With an MOU in place, the company has been busy working with its co-development partners to progress development in the second half of 20. And as the tailwinds behind Alberta's emerging data center industry continue to swirl, 2025 is shaping up as an exciting year for Kalina Power and its shareholders.